everybody, it's Michelle Patterson here with Angel Souls and it's our daily card reading for October 20th, 2021. Let's see what we have going on for today. Please make sure that you watch the weekly. Okay, and I do have the All 12 Signs Overview uh, video up for October. We had a card pop out here. We have perspective. Your whole perspective this week. Something happens and it just blows the lid off it. I thought it was this, but no. It was that. <laughs> and it might be a heavy, heavy, heavy burden that you have been carrying for forever. Or maybe it feels like for forever. All right. I have a funny story. I don't know why this just came up. Um, yesterday, I was having a really rough day trying to be into wellness and everything. Um, speaking of heavy burdens, and I'm trying to, you know, lighten my, my body, lighten my frequency, you know, do all this stuff. And I went out for a hike <laughs> and I smelled cheeseburgers. And I'm like, now that's odd. What the heck? I come around the corner, there's an in and out burger truck, okay, in the parking lot. And I'm not talking like a putt-putt food truck. I'm talking a semi. A semi was out there with burgers. And I was like, man, <laughs> I feel like my bad habits, like for wanting greasy food and everything, they chase me. No, but <laughs> that was just a funny thing. We were talking about lighten the load and whatever, but it is. It does feel like sometimes when you're trying to process something, like there's a, you know, in my case, I'm trying to eat better and there's a stinking semi with cheeseburgers in it. Who's that happened to? Why? Why? It was just a weird day anyway. And then that. But, you know, when you see things come up and, you know, there is a true obstacle. The example I just gave was a silly one. But there's a true obstacle there. This is asking you to stop, take a pause, and, and gain some perspective around that. What is that thing that's going on there? So it might be asking you to not just uh, be all doom and gloom. Okay, or assume the worst or assume the worst about people or get into the space of thinking that everyone's just out to get you kind of thing. All right, so this is Archangel Shamuel. Archangel Shamuel is known as the Archangel of Love and relationships. They are pounding us over the head with this romantic, well, not really romantic, but like relationship messages all over the place. Okay, fine. So <laughs> it, it says here, there's a better way, pause for reflection and insight dare to be different. See, this is defensiveness. This is being triggered. This is, um, I ran away from a situation because, and I've done this myself, where something's going on. I'm coming from my pained place, my cracked lens, if you want to see it that way. And all I knew was, I, I feel like I'm in danger. I got to pull back. I have to protect myself. I have to, you know, I have to be there for me because you can't trust people, right? I was in that phase and yeah, I ran away from lots of situations. I can apply that to a lot of things instead of just facing it head on and getting clarity. So this might be something that you're realizing today where you're like, okay, I need to stop with this perspective that I have to be in constant fight mode or in constant defense mode, having my walls up, being so guarded. How many of you out there are not in love partnerships? Okay. Because your heart is so guarded. I've been, um, I'll offer this too. I have been reading up on Pluto and the various signs for the various generations. Fascinating. Blew my mind. I'm going to study it some more. Now, my generation is uh, Pluto. Pluto is in Libra. And just reading all of the stuff about, you know, who we were probably raised by and what that perspective was, you know. So again, look into little things like that. Like, that, as an example, changed my perspective. So where can you find some bit of information that helps you in seeing things in a different way? Because there is something, I feel like there is good news. Hey, I'm behind you. Hey, it's not as bad as you thought. Hey, some of you out there, you haven't heard about a job that you really wanted. And it's because the company was going through a lot of shifts and changes and trying to decide on, you know, whether they could hire someone or not. And now it's going to come through if it's meant for you. Okay. If it's meant for you. Now, if you're someone out there watching this and you're like, I didn't get the job. That's okay. That's okay, honey. I mean, congratulations, even with that, <laughs> because now you're not getting stuck in a situation that is not right for you. You're still open for the right thing. Okay. So give all these things some time to, to think about, you know, and just see where it lands for you. We're going to leave it there. I'm sending you all so much love and take care.